Tuesday, keeping it real, keeping it you. What's that you say? Keeping it real, keeping it real. All right, we are here. You love this, right? I love this to death. I'm, yeah. I was going to get a white Russian for right now. Are you an achiever? What? Are you an achiever? Achiever? An achiever. Oh, achiever? Nah. <laughs> no, I, I know your store. Uh, the Little Lebowski shop on Thompson Street. That's right. This is him at. right here. You're even dressed for the occasion. Yeah, I, I have my dude sweater on. I'm jealous. And the khaki pants. Yeah, yeah, but not even a bathrobe. No, no I, I skipped the bathrobe today. Yeah. I thought the sweater would be more it, it, it really suits you. Yeah. Yeah. It's kind of, well, I used to have longer hair. But, uh, but I cut it recently. And how do you feel about that? Uh, I miss it. Yeah. Yeah, I miss it. But it used, it used to come better. Thank you very much. Oh, so do you? You've seen the movie. I love the movie. Yeah. yeah. I I found out about your place from one of my friends. He's in a band. They were from Vermont. They're called the Midnight Saints, and um, I sent them to Generation Records, which is right across the street. And he there's another band from a really great band from Indianapolis was staying with us at the time too. They're called Mr. Clip and Pink Cigarettes. Oh, I love them. And then when they were giving them the directions, it's yeah, it's right by the Big Lebowski place. And when we talking about the Big Lebowski place. There's just a store right there. It's like Little Lebowski. And I'm like, what? So I went down there with him. I saw the store. I was like, this is fucking awesome. I mean, I've been going to Generation since it opened in the 90s. And then I hadn't been there in years because of digital age. But yeah, no, I, I, one day, I go by your store all the time. I, one day I'm going to take a picture with the dude outside. With the big dude outside? Yeah, that'll be my face. Yes, it's stuff. chained up because people steal it? Yeah. How yeah. many have I you done for about four. Really? Yeah, it's a my, my business partner is an artist and he he does these cutouts ah. of the characters from the movie. So out front of the store we have a giant cutout of the dude. And uh, people keep stealing them. Gosh. So we actually have to change it up. Now when you <laughs> chain it, do they still steal it? No, we haven't had any problems since we changed it up. That's good. So okay. he's like on a leash. Yeah, he's like yeah, he's definitely on a leash. There you so, go. So nobody walks off with our dude. Wow. <laughs> so when did you open the store? Uh, we've been there. We've been there about six years now. Wow. And what what is your best item that you sell in the store? The best item? Uh, well, I think the the, the items that sell the best are the t-shirts. Yes. Uh, and probably we have one now that says a, it's a Walter shirt, a Walter Sochak that says you're entering a world of pain. Yeah. <laughs> it's got a picture of John Goodman on the front. You know, with the yeah. with the uh, with the uh, with the he has sunglasses on. He's in a new movie. Have you seen the promos he's for that? Everything. Whoa, he he's really Roseanne to the world, man. You know? He's a terrific actor. He, he is. is. I saw him in a restaurant once. He's a terrific eater too. He's uh, yeah, I, I can imagine. I don't want to go there. Uh, Revenge of the Nerds. <laughs> right? He's the coach on Revenge of the Nerds. It was one of his first films. Yeah. And he also did the David Byrne movie. Yes. Uh, True stories. Yes. He was the uh, the lovelorn uh, teacher. Nice. Yeah. Wow. So, have you met him? I, I have not met him, but we, we have a, a photo on the wall of him. Uh, we, through, through some friends uh, of ours that were doing an interview with him, we were able to give him his own autographed uh, Little Lebowski bowling pin. Oh, that's cool. Oh, which so which nice. had a, a picture, which had a, a painting of Walter Sochak on the front. <laughs> that's awesome. And, uh, and it said, Dear John, thanks for all your great work. So, they gave it to him at dinner. And uh, dinner. He, and he had to give it to him at dinner, and uh, he liked it, so he held it up, and they took the photo. <coughs> and I was walking home and got this strange email that just said he likes it. Ah. And I was about to delete it, and I was like, oh, no, wait, ah, There's oh, he likes it, I got it. Oh, and then I saw the picture, and I was yeah. like, oh, that's great. That you know? does happen, though. I have deleted things by accident yeah. that probably... Yeah, no, thank God I didn't delete it. We have a photo on the wall. Thank God. Yeah. So, um, it is the holiday season, and... Um, have people been coming in, or do you find that people shop more online these days? Like, do people shop the same way they used to before online took it all over? I don't know. They don't shop the way they used to. And, and oddly enough, primarily, most of my business comes from tourists. Ah, uh, well, that makes sense. Uh, especially they Euro shop. Especially Europeans. Because tourists are here to shop. Like, when you go, or when you're a tourist, do you shop more than you do when you're home? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, probably. But exactly. It's like the open wallet when you're away, when you're home. It's 
Close. It's close. Yeah. But we get a lot of Europeans. That's good. So because I get a lot of Europeans that ask me which way to Greenwich Village. So you know, you send them to Greenwich tell Village. Them with, send them to the little Yeah, that I will from this day forward. Exactly. So um, do you find which kind of Europeans shop or? Well, we get a lot of Germans. Japanese. Uh, no Germans. Uh, a lot of Germans, French, Italian, uh, Belgium. Now, do they all know the movie? Oh, they all know the movie. They, they know do. the movie better than I do. So they know specifically to come to your show. Yeah, store. yeah, they know. So are you like located like in tourist books? Like, is your store a hot? Body? Yeah, we're we're. I wear the bathroom at work. Yeah. And uh, we're we're in all the tourist guides. In the German you. One, in the German one, uh, they wrote that I'm the crazy guy in the bathroom. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that gets a lot of Germans there. Yes, we get a lot of Germans. It's not very German to to be so casual, right? Well, I think they're more casual than people think. Oh, that's good. That's you know, good. They seem to really get a kick out of the, the nihilists. Uh huh. Because you know, they all want to come in into lines with me. Ah. Uh, they want to drop the nihilist lines. You know, they want to, they want to do a contest with me to see how well I can do if I can do the lines better than than, than they can. Can you do it, yeah? Uh, Devantamani Labowski. That's good. But they're always better at it than I am because they're authentic. Yeah. Yeah. So, do you have a an item that you'd like people to come check out the most? Uh, well, um, I think everything we have is great. So yeah, and the address is just I know it's Thompson Street. Two fifteen Thompson Street. Two fifteen. That's my what, brother's what's birthday. What's the most unique item you have? Uh, the most for, unique for sale. For sale. For sale. The most unique item we have. Um, I have to think about that for a minute. Uh, probably we have we have autographed copies of Two Gentlemen of Lebowski, which is the Shakespearean version of The Big Lebowski. Two Gentlemen of our Some, own. Somebody man. rewrote the script in Shakespearean oh, version. That is that's hilarious. You can come down and pick up your copy. So it's an time. ionic pentameter? Yes, it is an ionic pentameter. Wow. Awesome. That is cool, actually. Yeah. That's funny. Yep. Yeah, that's a... Have that's you ever a, read it? Yes, I have. Really? Yep. Is it interesting? Like, can you pay attention to it? Oh, yeah. No, it's hilarious. <laughs> it's, it's totally the, the Big Lebowski. It's just yeah. all the dialogue is rewritten. Wow. You know, one of the, the best lines is, um, Dost thou see what happens, Lawrence, when thou first the stranger twitches the pipes? Yeah. <laughs> 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 no, now, can you translate that? Uh, this is what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass. Oh! <laughs> well, that's that's right. Right. Yeah, yeah, why not? Yes, yeah. 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 <laughs> so, uh, it happens to be National Lager Day. Do you like lager? It would be very undue if I did. Yeah. So, would you like to have a sip of lager? Yes, I will have a sip uh, of Would you like your own straw, or are you okay with um, using a straw that's on there? All right, that's why we, we aim to please. This, this is the communal lager. Yeah, that's right. So, it is the communal lager, but you can take a giant sip. And... Um, and then you can share with us a skeleton from your closet, please. Um, well, I can tell you a story about some of the customers. That would work. That's fine. I had a, uh, the store attracts all kinds. I had a woman come in once who turned out to be a dominatrix. And uh, she got very excited when she came to the store because her boyfriend loved the movie. And uh, she ended up buying like 20 Lebowski shirts. Nice. So I'm ringing her up at the counter. And she's jumping up and down, and all of a sudden she screams, I'm getting so late tonight. That's so so <laughs> late? Oh, because she bought 20 yeah, shirts. Yeah, she bought like 20 shirts for her boyfriend. She's uh, like, I'm getting so late tonight. And what, she's a prostitute, you said? Yeah, she was a dominatrix. Oh, oh, oh. So oh, this, oh, was, oh. this was for her boyfriend. So, um, that's cool. It was a little weird. Did she tell you she was a dominatrix? Yes, she did. Yeah. Because how would you have known? She, she told me. And she told you that those, those t-shirts were all for one person, her boyfriend. Who yeah, the yeah. she was like, my boyfriend is a, is a huge... Did I, she leave her business card? Was it 20 of the same or 20 somewhere. different? It was 20 different. Oh, okay. It was all different with that. So you have, how many different shirts do you have? Uh, we've got at least 25. So she, but why didn't she pick the other five? I guess she was tapped out. But <laughs> <laughs> um bump Exactly. I, guess, I guess she had enough. Wow. Know? She figured she figured the twenty or whatever. Where'd you grow up? I grew up in New Jersey. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I said, oh, is that a problem? What accent? <laughs> oh, what accent? But I'm from. Yeah. But I'm from. So what's in the bag, my friend? The bag? Well, I bought you. Uh, I 
Jude talking bobblehead. Oh, my oh God. God. Oh. Can I rewrap this and give it as a front one? No, no. Oh, no. I keep Do you this. have that at your store? Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Dude. Oh, my God. That, that needs to be in my life. Insane. Insane. Yes. So if I don't take it out of the box, is it worth more? Uh, Probably. Yeah, right? But, but that's not much fun. No. If you take that out of the box, it, it has Jeff Bridges' voice. Yeah. It, Have you ever met oh. him? Yes, has he been to the store many times? He's been in once. Once? Yeah, he came in once. They did a documentary for PBS. Yes. And uh, they were doing a documentary about him for PBS. And so they brought him in to see the store. How cool is that? Was he, like, blown away? Yeah, well, he was great. He walked in, and the first thing he said was, Cool store, man. Oh. Where'd you get all this stuff from, man? Yeah, where did you get it all from, man? Well, it's all licensed merchandise. Yeah. We get it from different wholesalers, people in the license rights. Right. You know. So so it is available in other places as well. You can get it in other places. We just have more of it. Right. It's more fun to come to our store. It is. This our is store amazing. is sort of like it's sort of like the That is awesome. Store. Oh my god. This is classic. Oh wow. Thank you so much. What else you got? Uh, I made homemade miniature apple pies. Are you serious? Do you know last week was apple pie day? You're one week late. This is for for you and your group. Oh my god. Oh my. It was apple pie day last week. Oh, those, oh so wow. Is, those are uh you made these? Yeah, I made them. I made them this morning. A little miniature apple pie. Do you have like a special family recipe or something? No, no. I just uh, just kind of. You have the urge? Was experiment. I like to cook. Wow, Jonesy. All right, the ladies first. Uh, <laughs> uh, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Do you want one? I'm okay. I had enough. How many did you have? Two. That's it. To what is this called? Like this is. Do I have to give you a skeleton? It's a. It's it looks a, like a pierogi. It's it's an empanada. An empanada. It's I knew it had something. It's an empanada. It smells so good oh all the way God, over these here. These are adorable. Yeah, it's an empanada with apple pie filling. Oh. oh shit. So did you make <laughs> like like did you did you make these before? No, I did this this morning. I know. So first time. Uh, um, well, I've made well the uh, I I've made empanadas before. This is the first time I've done it. I've made apple pies before. But this is the first time I've done the apple. Wow. Oh, oh my. You. That smells good all the way over wow, here. You'll get You'll get Wow. This is good. Wow, it does taste like apple pie. Yep. Wow. So what's you your sell website? This at the store. It's uh, www.littlelebowskishop.com. That sounds great. And, um, yeah, go shop there, everybody. Do you sell these at the store? I might, I might bring them in. They'll probably do better than the merchandise. <laughs> well, people might, you know, yeah. eat in the shop. We'll, we'll probably be busy uh, the last two weeks, or two weeks after Christmas. Oh. Uh, we'll the come in for New Year's. Sounds good. Yeah. So we want to push a button? Sure. Yeah, yeah that's it. That's like how his head goes. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you so much for visiting. Thank you for having me. Yes, the little Lebowski shop. Go now. We'll be right back. More room. Who and who? What's that you say? Who and who? What's that you say? There's a quirky, cool new internet show. Featuring rising stars and living legends too. It's a life, fun time, and full of surprises. 